I'm Brittany McGraw and this is your 10 News Update. One of four people charged in connection with the death of a Henry County woman has died in jail. According to the Henry County Sheriff's Office, Tana Fitzgerald died Thursday morning at a hospital after taking an excessive amount of prescription blood pressure medication yesterday. Fitzgerald was arrested in May and was indicted on several charges, including first degree murder connected to the death of Pamela Morse. Governor Ralph Northam and others cut the ribbon to the Golden Piedmont facility that aims to bring dozens of jobs to South Boston. They expect to produce 5,000 pounds of hemp a day. The company then produces CBD oil to be distributed to companies domestically and internationally. Full production is slated to begin by the end of the month. VMI is moving to online learning because of the coronavirus. The superintendent announced all cadets will be furloughed from post in phases. That will start Friday, November 20th. Virtual learning starts three days later. Leaders say COVID-19 trends and Thanksgiving travel were both factors in the decision. Right now, cadets are scheduled to return to post for the spring semester in January. A reminder that you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm Brittany McGraw, 10 News, working for you.